Right, thanks, Dan. Survivors of sexual assault will get greater access to help in Hillsborough County in the new year. The Crisis Center of Tampa Bay plans to open a new facility in an underserved part of the county. ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell explains the difficulty some people face when looking for help and how these new resources will help pave a way to healing. Sure. So Jennifer like Thayer is here to help those facing some of the toughest traumas in their life. We believe you and we are here to help you. She's the director of nursing at the Crisis Center of Tampa Bay and oversees the team of sexual assault nurse examiners. But everything goes back in this envelope. The Crisis Center provides specialized services to survivors of sexual assault in Hillsborough County. But currently, these services are provided at the main facility in North Tampa, what can be a significant trek for folks in South Hillsborough County. Spending three to six hours here and then a whole another hour or more drive home, um, it really deters people from coming and seeking out the services that they need. And for people without access to transportation, that can be an upwards of a three and a half hour bus ride to try to get here one way for an exam that can take on average five hours and then another three and a half hour bus ride home. If you can get a bus, forget it. Folks just weren't doing that. Now the crisis center is expanding access with plans to open a second sexual assault services facility in Ruskin next August. Crisis center president and CEO Clara Reynolds explains South County has seen a big population boom and has a population that's underserved when it comes to crisis intervention services. By having two centers that will be working simultaneously, we hope to eliminate any wait for any victim of sexual assault to get the help and support that they need. The new facility will be within the Hillsborough County South Shore Community Resource Center, letting survivors know they never need to face a crisis alone, no matter where they are. In Hillsborough County, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.